Hi guys, welcome back and in this video, I will talk about how to make 1 lakh rupees per month from home and working online. Now this ain't like any other video that I have made because I will tell you how I started making 1 lakh per month when I started out. Now for those of you who are new to this channel, I am Chavi, owner of a 5 figure work from home blog. We make videos on working from home and making money online. So take a moment, hit the red icon below and subscribe to my channel. The first thing first, I started out my first blog in 2016, which was a travel blog, but it was such a mess, a complete disaster and of course a failure. Now, instead of focusing on going ahead with that blog, I decided to learn more about it, more about blogging and writing. That is when I decided to take up freelance writing. Now, within a month of month or two of freelancing full time, I reached thousand dollars or seventy thousand rupees in a month. In the next six months, I was constantly making over one lakh rupees per month, freelancing and working with clients globally and writing for them. So let's talk a bit about how you can make one lakh rupees a month as well. Now, first off, you need to decide on a service you want to provide as a freelancer. Now there are more than 150 to 200 services you can offer and you don't have to research on that. You can find a link to these services in the first comment below. So check that out. Now go through the list and decide on two to three services that you can provide initially. If you're, if you're comfortable with one, you can go ahead with that too. So I decided to just go ahead with content writing and nothing else because I wasn't sure of it. So if you're in the similar boat, you can go ahead with one service as well. There is no problem with that. Now, the second step that you need to take is to create a portfolio. Now, if you are a complete beginner, pick up a few topics or projects and make that your portfolio. For example, if you are a writer, pick up at least 30 topics in different niches and write them. You can learn how to do this in this video I have made on how to become a content writer, which you can find here. Similarly, if you are providing, for example, graphic designing services, then pick up different formats and create five to six designs for each. So design social media graphics, brochures, posters, ebooks, covers, etc. Now you can put together your portfolio on different platforms like Medium, Google Drive, Contently, etc. You can also start a basic services website and publish your portfolio there. And you can then share the link with your potential clients. And this is the method that I would prefer you to start with. Now the third one. The third step that you need to take is to decide on a basic pricing for your services. But this is an extremely important step. Now, how do you do that? So work backwards, work backwards from the goal you have set for yourself. In this case, we are talking about how to make 1 lakh rupees a month. So let's take that as your goal as well. Now, let's say you are a writer and you know, at best, you can write about 16 posts a month. That is four re well-researched posts in a week. Now, if you want to earn 1 lakh rupees with 16 posts in a month, then for each post, you will need to charge approximately 6,000 a post. So that's what you charge. You charge 6 rupees per word or 6,000 a post. I also understand that not many clients are eager to pay you that, but you will need to put in the effort to find clients that pay you that much money. Now, why is that important? That is important because if you keep charging low, if you keep charging pennies, you will quickly burn yourself out and you will quit. Now, if you, if you work with high paying clients, you will find happiness in your work and you will be motivated to work harder. And this is what we want. It will also be easier for you to reach your income goals and be happy with it. Now, your fourth step is to find clients, which is the most important step as a freelancer. Now, there are thousand and one ways to find clients, but the best one is to learn pitching them directly or pitch them through a good job board. You can also use Facebook groups to find clients that have small businesses online. And this is a really lucrative uh, client genre and will always, uh, almost always pay you well. And I highly, highly recommend uh, doing this, going and networking on uh, Facebook groups. Just stick to these three ways, job boards, Facebook groups and pitching and in that order and one at a time. So don't, you don't overwhelm yourself. Now, uh, this is a one way to make 1 lakh rupees in a month, but this requires your active involvement in finding clients um, with a few months where you will struggle. I have and you will too. It's okay. Now, freelancing has its own set of ups and downs and it demands time. Uh, it demands 
a constant time to be put in for it to remain profitable. Um, I wanted to have um, a passive income stream so that I can have more free time. So remember that uh, I told you that I had a blog in 2016, I revamped it. I started writing about how to become a freelance writer, shared my experiences, tricks, and it all came from my own experiences, from my heart to help others. And it was completely original content. Now it clicked, not in terms of getting traffic, but my interest, I loved writing about, I loved writing about it. And so the content came in naturally. It was original, it was helpful, it was nice, but that wasn't enough. So I decided to invest in learning Pinterest. Now that is one of the fastest ways to drive traffic to your blog. It won't take a day, but in about eight months, I had 30,000 hits to my website. Now, if you want to know about Pinterest, you can watch this video, the link to which you can find up top. Now, blogging isn't easy and it is definitely overwhelming, but you need to take one step at a time. One step, I'm repeating it because it is very important. One step at a time. So now I was creating content and focusing on Pinterest. I did this for almost three to four months straight before I invested in another course to learn about affiliate marketing. Now I had 10,000 hits in a month by this time and it was time for me to monetize the blog. I started researching on legit courses, apps, tools, etc., that I can recommend people and make money off commissions. In the same month, I began implementing the tricks as well and I made my first $100 and it was the biggest motivation of all to go ahead with this. Go ahead with something that was taking a lot of my time but was not making any money at all. At nine months mark, I was able to get into MediaWind, an ads company many, many, many bloggers thrive to be a part of. This is where I started making $1,000 constantly in each and every month. It is only after a year I started learning SEO and email marketing one at a time, one at a time. Today, it has been more than 2.5 years that I am blogging and I earn anywhere from $3,000 to $7,000 in a month passively. It is now that I quit freelance writing completely to pursue a more time independent and passive income stream like blogging, which I love. I've also started a few other blogs. So you can either pick freelancing or blogging to make 1 lakh rupees in a month from home or pick both of them like I did. The choice is yours, but it can definitely happen. Now, if you're interested in freelance writing, I have a free course for you to take and jumpstart. I also have a freelancing kit which gives you everything you need to look, uh, you need to um, look and sound professional from the start with your clients. This is important because your client needs to understand that you know what you're doing. They need to trust you and it helps build credibility. I will leave the links to both of these resources in the description box below. And if you want to start blogging, you can grab my freebie called the blogging headway. It will help you with all the basics and will also help you get started. If you like it, you can then consider investing into the content mojo where I share about how to drive traffic, how to write content, etc. Links are in the description box below. Now, I don't hold back and I have given you all the details in this video. I've also given all the details in the training programs that I've created free or paid and that has worked for me. Okay, those things work, those tricks work. You can find more videos on how to work from home and how to make 1 lakh rupees per month from home with them. Uh, and you can see those videos on the screen right now. So go ahead, click on it and watch them. And do not forget to hit the red icon below and subscribe to my channel. If you have any doubts and any questions about how to make 1 lakh rupees per month from home as a freelancer or as a blogger, don't forget to comment below and let me know. I respond to all comments that I get from my viewers. Now I will take a leave and I'll see you next week. Till then, bye-bye.